Hello everyone, I totally didn't accidentally end the last part earlier than I meant to or anything. Every human that falls down here meets the same fate. I have seen it again and again. They come, they leave, they die. You may have tried if you leave the ruins. They, Askor, they carry you. Maybe she's not evil. <laughs> See, yeah. I've changed my opinion since the last part. <laughs> you changed it pretty fast, to be fair. I mean, though I still would prefer she didn't destroy the exit, I kind of see her reasoning if everyone's just going out and dying. But I still say she's going to be the final boss. <laughs> I'm only protecting you. Do you understand? Go to your room. Nah, though, I gotta I'll be the hero. Face. Do not try to stop me. This is your final warning. Now what oh. you gonna do, bitch? You're trying to not kill me, so what are you gonna do to me? I think she's gonna probably fight us. But that would include killing us, so fuck her. She, she can't kill us. <laughs> hmm. Yeah, just like the others. There's only one solution to this. Prove yourself. Prove to me you are strong enough to survive. Told Talk you. to me. Toriel blocks the way. Talk. You couldn't think of any conversation topics. Wow, I'm bad at this. Ah, oh, what is that? Oh, okay. Oh, oh, ow. Toriel is acting aloof. I did think of something to say again, but... Completely failed. Wow. You should insert a fucking pie. These are getting a lot harder. Toriel prays a magical attack. Please stop, Toriel. Ironically, talking does not seem to be the solution to this situation. I think I'm trying to tell you something. Yeah, I think so too. Like the fact that I'm gonna die. Ah, uh, spare. Maybe. No. It doesn't. She does not want to spare. Maybe look at her. Maybe look at her. And make her feel bad. 80 defense 80 knows best for you Maybe I should um flee That is right go upstairs What? <laughs> yes, good What will it take for you to learn your lesson? If you Oops. beat me to death, I'm sure I will learn my lesson. Ah, uh, okay, let's I'm pretty beat up right now. Right, go upstairs. Go to sleep. Wait, Come back heck? tomorrow. Hmm? My inventory is glitching out. There we go. For whatever reason, it's just in that room. Get the toy knife and impale on it. <laughs> I'd rather not. <laughs> Let's call her on the cell phone. Nobody picks up. What will it take for you to learn your lesson? I don't know. Wait, you could go here. Alright, I guess I should. I'm just worried, like... I'm not sure how this game scripts it. What if I go upstairs and she destroys the door while I'm away? Because that would actually, you know, make sense. Right, then you... Load. Yeah, I guess so. I guess if the worst comes to it, we can see what kind of game over state I get if I don't prove I'm strong enough. But I do distinctly need to heal here. I mean, okay. no, you could have healed at a safe point. Not by having gone to sleep, I think you've literally <laughs> get yourself. Uh, green. Well, I don't know, too, Bobby. I don't know. I don't know who this is. Green, please wake up. You are the future of humans and monsters. Okay, well, Where I am here? fully healed. <laughs> worth, it. worth it and we got to see whatever that was see I'm the future of humans and monsters maybe I'm a half breed what a twist maybe goat mom is actually your mother yeah that'd <laughs> be interesting hi god you take a long time to do this she really does I mean you know this game wouldn't be over already if you just destroyed the door 
Maybe you do have to punch your face. I was acting aloof. Maybe it's so, but I'm gonna try talking more. You already tried it 18 times. Okay, attack. Well, wait, how does attacking work? Okay, well, I, I think didn't you really do you anything. Said. Why are you almost dead? Because she's doing a lot of damage. It's not seeming to be the solution. Are you sure? I think you try giving her an item. You should give her some spider cider. Oh, I drank it. I was no really useful. Dang, I really suck. I don't at know. This. I don't know if you should. Yeah, I don't know if you're proving your independence by getting drunk in front of her. This. Okay. I think you're supposed to punch her. I don't know. Maybe I do have to beat her up. I mean, you beat her up and you don't kill her. Like it's a pacifist if you don't kill her, right? Yeah, I think so. So you have to hit like as close to the middle as you can, I think? Yeah, that seems to be the idea for it. Ooh, I actually dodged once. I'm sorry, Toriel. I hope this I'm is... Not. Oh. He deserves it. She asked for this, don't forget. I don't even think I'm going to be able to be Toriel. Like, honestly, I- oops. Dang. If you don't get hit, you can. <laughs> okay, sure, if I was actually good at this game, maybe. See, that one's easy. Yeah, that was weird. Wow. That was some critical damage. Like, she seems to be not even trying to hit me anymore. She's specifically Maybe trying to Maybe she's bleeding out on the floor. Okay, just trying to spare her doesn't work. Keep punching her. You gotta gut her. <sighs> oh, okay, I have to keep trying to spare her, that's it. Where's the murder in you? <laughs> I don't want to murder anyone. But she deserves it. She tried to kill you. She's trying to protect me from myself. It's an understandable reaction. Not in, not to me. What are you doing? What are you doing? <laughs> doing nothing. The best solution. I like how me and her had the same question. Like, the fuck <laughs> are you doing? I take her one away. No. I think she derped out. I think you both derped out. You're just having a derp fight on the floor. What are you proving this way? I'm proving that I don't have to fight anyone! I can... As long as you don't actually hit me, like, you're not really proving <laughs> anything because she doesn't hit you either. True. Fight me or leave. I think I sure just realized the reason she isn't finishing me is because I'm so low on HP. So she's not hitting me because I could die. This is completely... Wait, can you save then? I actually could, maybe, I don't know. <laughs> but I don't so, think that's the idea. <laughs> I don't think you're convincing her either. I'm totally convincing her, it's fine. Go away! No. I'm this is the most special <laughs> Ed fight I've ever watched. It's. I wonder if I, I might actually not be accomplishing anything this way. It's just. Okay, I thought maybe I could. Kill yourself! Make her fly as she kills you. <laughs> I literally don't think I can kill myself here. <laughs> right, then impale her on your sword as she refuses to kill you. She's terrible at teaching you a lesson. Yeah, I admittedly, um... Oops, that was a really bad attack. Good job, me. I thought I could, like, I honestly thought I could fix this if I tried to spare her hard enough. Apparently, it does not, like... That you know, maybe doesn't work because you're already dead. Maybe, I don't know. 
I'm so confused by this fight. What the fuck is going on? You just... Yes, <laughs> now finish her! <laughs> Unleash the dark side in you. You are stronger than I thought! Mostly you just didn't finish You're me off. You're weaker than I expected, but stronger than I thought. You're you're weak enough that I had to not kill you for like twenty turns, but you know. Listen to me, small one. If you go beyond this door, keep walking as far as you can. Eventually, you will reach an exit. Oscar, do not let Oscar. Take your soul. Everyone else can take your soul, though. That's fine. <laughs> His plan cannot be allowed to succeed. Be good, won't you? My child. If I didn't hate you so much, that would be kind of sad. Did he kill her? I think I did. Did I mess up? Shit. You exploded her. That's good. I like it. Ah, <laughs> uh, I feel like I ruined this whole pacifist. Look at the thing. door, though. It's happy. It's really happy. It is really happy. I think I need to load, though. I don't know. I think you did the right thing. I mean, I, oh. I, it's. I'm kind of not sure if you can avoid killing her, but that's really bothering me because I'm pretty sure you can. I mean, uh, the tagline for this game is basically you don't have to kill anyone if you don't want to. But you didn't kill her, you just made her feel weak. She, she's fine. Oops. But in any case, uh, GG. Yeah. Don't look at any of my Steam stuff that's totally not there, guys. Oops. <laughs> or or any, anything else going on here. I'm totally not uh, just totally restarting the game here. I mean, See, that's good, Mom. She's even. That is Goat Mom right there. But... I think Flowey. I think Flowey is the true hero of this game. Okay. Wait, now we gotta redo this. Yeah, I'm actually not sure where we messed up. I'm going to tell her that I'll stay. I wonder if maybe the idea is you sneak off and you don't have to fight her if you're not a dick. <laughs> But are you saying I was being a dick? I'm I'm am saying you were being a dick. I mean, at the most, I like at the I, I kind of understand where you're coming from, but it was pretty clear she wanted us to stay here. We could have at least um entertained the thought for her. I don't know. I'm not. A, I will never lie. <laughs> I will always be truthful, even if it means truthfully stabbing someone in the face. Well, then that's <laughs> really dumb. I'm sorry. Up already, I see. Like, go die. Um, <laughs> there's so many of my books I want to share. I want to show you my favorite bug hunting spot. She she hunts bugs. She's not a pacifist. Those bugs are Felix, too. Ah. <laughs> uh... Nothing. Hey, talk to me again if you need anything. Okay. Let's try going downstairs. Let's see if we can like just gotta... leave without her permission. But then you don't even know where you're she's... going. You just accidentally... Nope, she's gonna kick your face in. <laughs> I think you should play upstairs instead. <laughs> wow, see? she just wrecks you there. Yeah, okay, so we have to insist we want to go. How do we not kill her then? Maybe she didn't die. Maybe, maybe she was just being overdramatic. Maybe she was just gonna go, like... Pigeku or whatever the good. She was gonna go Dragon Ball Z on this and just come back two minutes later. <laughs> Maybe, I don't really know. Maybe she here's, really is dead. Here's an exciting snare fact. Did you know that snares sometimes flip? No, we already knew that. Yeah. Yeah, it was interesting. Well, bother me if you have a life. Okay, I want to leave. And then she'll go do that, and, um... I don't know, there was the voice when we try and go to bed. How about I try and sleep again? 
No, it's not even showing up this time. Okay, so you haven't gone down there yet? Yeah, I guess so. Let's search her room. Maybe I can, uh... Toriel's Diary. I ain't go overthinking this. Maybe I am overthinking this. I don't know. Maybe you have to tear some skeleton jokes. <laughs> Maybe I should, um... Take a snail book. She seemed to really like snails. It'd be funny if that was the solution. You just really need to have no snail stuff. It's a history book. Here's a random page. Well, we know that. Actually, it was... It was a different fact, but whatever. Oh, okay. Sorry. Our king is pretty bad with names. Or was it not? I thought it was. It looked different, but whatever. Yeah. I don't know. I'm probably overthinking this. I mean, it doesn't seem like the type of game you have to have an item uh, in battle, but this is kind of confusing me. Only because you have some weird objection to bloody murder. I don't care. <laughs> yeah, I mean, for one, I really want to not kill Toriel, and for two, I... Um, I want to have an actual pacifist run. That was the entire point of why I'm playing this game. Really? You're only playing it for a pacifist run? I mean, well, the fact that it gives you the option for reasonable pacifist run. I, if I wanted to go around and kill things, you know, I have a million RPGs for that. But, I mean, that's, that's the entire idea of the game, right? You can not kill anyone. Yeah, I thought, I thought the idea of the game was to be a complete psychopath. <laughs> you can do that too, and who knows, maybe uh, one day we will, but... Dang it. It's not... okay. Yeah, I guess I'm just... gonna leave you to your devices and I'll just sit here and just grumble about you not caring things. She has so much dialogue for not attacking her. It seems weird for something that's not actually important possibly. Stop looking at me like that. I refuse to stop looking at me like that. No, she won't hit you. Yeah. Look at how sad she looks. She wants to die. Here we go. Okay, we screwed up last time by attacking her at all, I think. I know you want to go home, but... But please, go upstairs now. I promise I will take good care of you. See, I told you. She's smiling. It's creepy. <laughs> I know we do not have much, but... We can have a good life here. Why are you making this so difficult? Because it's what I do. Please, go upstairs. <laughs> Pathetic, is it not? I cannot save even a single shot. Well, I am pretty persistent. No, I understand. You would just be unhappy trapped down here. The ruins. Are very small once you get used to them. It would not be right for you to grow up in a place like this. My expectations, my loneliness, my fear. For you, my child, I will put them aside. God Yay. damn it. <laughs> oh. If you truly wish to leave the ruins, then keep walking. <laughs> oh no. I will not stop you. However, when you leave, please do not come back. I hope you understand. I don't, actually. <laughs> uh, I don't understand either, but I'm happy. 
Goodbye, my child. Imagine if you do leave the ruins, you get through all of this, mm -hmm. and then you climb back on the mountain and fall into the hole again. <laughs> it's just like, sup, mom, I'm back. <laughs> Uh, that would be funny. Uh, well, I mean, I need to restore my health before we go. I, they might have a save point. I don't know. I'm gonna use the bed just in case. I'm a paranoid sort like that. I'm at 2 HP. It would suck to leave and immediately die like an idiot and then have to do That's that a hooded flower again. get in here. Evil this flower like guy? The... Yeah, I yeah. don't know. Such, this is like the cool place for the cool kids. You're the future of humans and monsters. Yeah, yeah, I know. She's not trying to destroy the gate anymore. I just need a nap. Jeez. It's like if Go she talk was to her one more time. <laughs> okay, yeah. So she has to save about life. Oh. She's dead. Kid herself. Hanged herself. That would be really depressing. They're making this so fun. Ah. Uh... But anyways, I say I knew there's a way to save everyone. You just gotta really try at it. But and I did too. You did? With a knife. <laughs> it's not the same. I mean, I really tried to make her not die, but she not my fault she is knife immune. <laughs> I mean, she does take a long time to die with a knife, but, I mean, admittedly, I don't even feel like that's well stated. Like, she doesn't run out of HP, she just, like, suddenly dies when she's been hit enough. It's kind of weird, but whatever. So she disappeared, I have full health now, and we can venture into the darkness and purple Even though it became brighter. Yeah. That's See, true. even brighter. It isn't even brighter purple. Wow. It's like we're almost going outside, but not really. Oh, it's no. It's flowy. I like this kid. Can we hug him? <laughs> no. Let's see. Was I... Yes. Clever. Very clever. Think you're really smart, don't you? This world, it's kill or be killed. So you're able to play by your own rules. You spared the life of a single person. <laughs> Don't act so cocky. I know what you did. You murdered her. And you went back because you were friends. <laughs> <laughs> oh god! Game! Uh... Stop! That is actually kind of creepy. <laughs> I blame Saper. It's, it's not my fault. I so, didn't do it. It's totally your fault. I don't know if I would have attacked her without your, uh... <laughs> Look at him! It's... Oh god! Uh, if he didn't... I didn't have time to it. You're lying, Chloe. <laughs> nice idiot. Think you're the only one with that power to save the game and load it? Wait, you can save <laughs> yes, the game and I load am. it? Yeah, god. I probably am. To shape the world purely by your own determination. Ability to play god. Ability to save... Wow, that is really meta. Yes, I assumed, you know, that I was the only one with that power, but I can't save anymore. Because, well, that's because I'm the new main character. I'm sorry. I guess now, now I have to make some mad. <laughs> Apparently, your desires for this world override mine. Well, yeah, you're kind of a jerk, so I don't... I'm fine with that. Well, well, enjoy that power while you can. I want just to. I want you to beat the game and get like an alternate character where you play as them. <laughs> I have to say though, it, it, doesn't that make him even more of an idiot? I mean, okay, sure, I can see him being upset because now we have the power to save, but. We have the power to save. He knows we have the power of the main character and cannot die. What's he planning on doing? We can well, load infinitely times. Him. Yeah, maybe. Because he knows that you killed her and then went back, not that you died and went back. Yeah, well, that's true. I'll be watching. <laughs> okay, what a face. Jeez. Can you give it a hug? Can I... Can I, I just... I, I trust him more than I trust Lo whatever the hell the woman was called. Tutorial? I yes. think I'd rather kill him personally, but just I'm not gonna kill, kill him. I know, I'm not gonna kill anyone. That's my goal. Undertale. Undertale. So wait, does she not show up for the rest of the game? By Toby Fox. 
My this actual made a lot of fuss about her for like just being the intro tutorial character. It's kind of funny though, considering he said that. I wonder how scripted that is. Like, I wonder if that. I wonder if it's not because we attacked her. I wonder if you have to load the game after you kill her at, to save her. Like, I don't know. Maybe, maybe not. Makes maybe the game just knows. <laughs> That'd be interesting. There's a camera hidden in the bushes. But yeah, if you have to load, I am sorry because obviously then nothing I did could have saved her the first time. But now we did save her, and that's all that really matters. Camera hidden in the bushes. Apparently, I can't do anything with it. I don't know why, but... It's fine. We're just in a creepy woods. With a... It's a tough-looking branch. It's too heavy to pick up. I know, we're, I know we're a kid, but come on. We can't pick that up. It's a tough-looking branch. What is this? Is this, like, gangster branch? <laughs> <laughs> Probably so. 50 cent, 50 branch. Uh, maybe that's why it's so, like, tough to pick up. Maybe it's, uh, got a Tommy gun stored away in its branch. Is branch. Branch focus. Yeah. This looks safe. Yeah, totally. Oh, that looks no. Nice. <laughs> Shadowy Friendly. figures. Um, human. Don't. You know how to greet a new Paul. <laughs> Turn around and shake my hand. I, I, I said you. <laughs> I'd love to. He's gonna rip your hand off. It's fine. Hey, it's, it's just a bony skeleton. Exactly, it's just a skeleton. <laughs> The old whoopee cushion in the hand trick. Oh, that's what that sound was. I couldn't even tell. I just heard a weird sound and I was like, what is that supposed to be a dramatic sting? It's always funny. Anyways, you're a human, right? That's hilarious. It sure is. I'm Sans. Sans a skeleton. I bet you can't guess why his name is Sans. I don't get it. Because of the text fonts, is words are oh, using. Oh, okay. <laughs> yeah. Like, it, it over screenshots, I couldn't tell the font. Thing. Oh, fair enough, yeah. I'm actually supposed to be on watch for humans right now. Well, I'm a human, so... You're pretty you good see. at your watch thing. Yeah. But, you know, I don't really care about capturing anybody. Fair enough. Just my mate, that creepy. <laughs> yeah. No, my brother pa Papyrus. Papyrus. He's a human hunting fanatic. Hey, actually, I think that's him over there. I have an idea. Go through this gate thingy. Yeah, go right through. My bro made the bus too wide to stop anyone. <laughs> I didn't realize they were supposed to stop anyone. That's a really useless thing Papyrus made. I'm so confused <laughs> by this game. <laughs> it's like, kind of weird. Who is on what side? <laughs> I don't know. The intricacy of all of this is way more than Game of Thrones. <laughs> <laughs> Certainly. Un game of Undertale. Quick, behind the convenient shaped lamp. Conveniently shaped. <laughs> that is really conveniently shaped. The fuck does I don't I'm the fuck he's like a Superman skeleton. <laughs> that's that's why I love him. He's a soup he's a skeleton in like a cape and stuff. <laughs> Sub bro. You know what's up, brother? It's been eight days and you still haven't recalibrated your puzzles. And you just hang around outside your station. What are you even doing? I have no idea. <laughs> Staying at this lamp, it's really cool. Do you wanna look? <laughs> what Why the would you... sentence is that? Staring at this lamp, it's really cool. <laughs> I said you don't want him to look at the lamp. I thought not either, but... 
No, I don't have time for that. Is he playing reverse psychology <laughs> with a skeleton? I guess so. What if a human comes through here? I want to be ready. I'll be the one. I must be the one. I will capture a human. Then I, the great Papyrus, will get all the things I utterly deserve. So wait, is this like Pokemon and humans are like the most <laughs> best Pokemon the best thing? Poke I guess so. It's kind of like the the monsters are human trainers. Gotta catch them all. Spect. Recognition. See, that's why the... Uh, what's the nice to you? I forgot her name again, but you Toriel. think she just won. She just won she was just a Pokemon trainer and she just wanted you to be a Pokemon. Oh, uh, that that's <laughs> funny, but the hoof's on the other foot now, cause we're the real Pokemon trainers, except you know, we're kicking monster butt with words. Finally be able to join the Royal Guard. People ask to be my friend. I'll bathe in a shower of kisses every morning. <laughs> Must be a really inefficient way to shower. <laughs> it sounds like it. Hmm. <laughs> Maybe this lamp will help you. Sans, you are not helping, you lazy bones. Is Sans evil or not? I'm so confused. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> I don't understand his point here. I, he's trying to get us caught by Papyrus, and yet he's doing the most inefficient job ever. Well, why well, don't you look at this get... lamp? Is he trying to get us caught, or is he trying to play reverse psychology? I don't even know. All you do is sit and bondoogle. What? I don't. Boondoggle? Sure. Get lazier and lazier every day! Hey, take it easy. I've gotten a ton of work done today. A skeleton. Oh no. Da, 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 da. <laughs> Damn it. <laughs> Sans! Do you think he wrote that joke that our friend had? <laughs> Probably so. I still don't remember her name. Toria? Yeah. <laughs> It's such a stupid Toriel. name. Is it? <laughs> I don't. I've never heard it before. Come Where? on, you're smiling. I am, and I hate it. Ah, why does someone as great as me have to do so much just to get some recognition? Wow, sounds like you're really walking yourself down to the bone. Oh no. <laughs> 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 He's the one as good as him. As, I think he might actually be better jokes than me. Oh, so I, I like him. They're they're actually pretty good. Ah, I will attend to my puzzles. As for your work, put a little more backbone into it. You're not good. <laughs> You're not funny. <laughs> I don't know. I think that was all right. That's not so as good. It just races against people who don't have backbone. <laughs> Like, what are snails gonna say about that? I think that's offensive. <laughs> I mean, snails don't generally have bones, so I guess. I don't know. <laughs> Wait, I, I guess anyone that's not a vertebrate. Mm. Right? Vertebrates have back bones? Fuck, I don't remember. I don't know. Okay, you can come out now. Uh, sure. You oughta get going. He might come back. And if he does... You have to sit through more of my hilarious jokes. Okay, we're staying. <laughs> yeah, why not? Just a conveniently shaped lamp. <laughs> now you can't hide behind it anymore. Yeah, some sort of checkpoint or sentry station. But there are bottles of ketchup, mustard, and relish sitting inside. <laughs> oh, I'm hungry. Yeah, it's kind of funny I can't actually hide any behind it. Actually, hey, hate to bother ya, but can you do me a favor? I was thinking, my brother has been kind of down lately. He's never seen a human before, and seeing you might just make his day. Don't worry, he's not dangerous. Even if he tries to be. D you just make me hide from him. <laughs> Thanks a million. I'll be up ahead. Yeah, that was... odd. But either way, time to get more determination. Convenience of that lamp still fills you with determination. This is weird if you come back to this point after, like, reading the game. <laughs> like, 
That lamb, that mm -hmm. was so determination. It was, it was a really good lamp. I love convenient lamps. <laughs> anyway, I think it's a good place to end it. Yeah, so after saving Goat Mom and that convenient exchange, I actually, it's funny, I actually do still like Papyrus. He seems interesting and kind of dumb. But, uh, Sans was pretty great. <laughs> Sans is best character. Yeah, I don't know why anyone so finds far. Goat Mom attractive. Sans is where I would. <laughs> yes, clearly. Scout. Comic Sans is the most sexy thing. Uh, Sans is great. I also liked that dapper ghost that we met near the beginning. Okay, yeah. He was good. Uh, but he, yeah, he will reappear. Uh, thank you all, and hopefully watching this filled you with determination. <laughs>